This is so cute. It's like the magic of their roommates' unity coming together, nestled safely in a box, preserved for a lifetime. In a beige, beige world, Mr. Kate is on a mission to break it. One, One two, two, three! three. Oh, oh my god. <gasps> you guys did such wow. a great job. So join us. Joey, we get it. You're really manly. Hello everybody, Creative Weirdos, welcome. We are doing Breaking Beige today for Aisha and Adeza, two roommates who live together in LA. They also love Harry Potter. Check it out. Hey guys, I'm Aisha Holden. My roommate Des is becoming a budding chef. And I would love for our apartment to be on Breaking Beige. This is our mini sparse walls. You know, we always have friends over. We're sort of like a hub. This place tends to be the gathering. We're growing up, so we like to host more like dinner party type situations. This is the view of the television from the couches. We would love for you guys to take a look at our place. Yeah, come check it out. They're so cute! Oh my gosh, we are going to do such an awesome job in that place. I'm very excited. And we haven't met them yet. They have a draft place. We're going to work on that floor plan and we're going to work on bringing their amazing personalities into the space. Guys, don't forget to subscribe! Oh yes! So you can go on more trips in this truck with us. Yes! Got to turn on that AC. We got a bunch of episodes of Break Your Face coming up, but for now, let's get Professionals have fallen prey to a disease I like to call the wall hugging disease. All the furniture is up against the walls. It's also hand me down and drab. There's also no conversation area when all the furniture lines the walls. They've got some slip covers, they've got vertical blinds, they've got ugly rental apartment light fixtures. The dining room is cluttered, and I know these girls like to entertain, so we have to make it way more inviting. And hey, look, do I see some Harry Potter throw pillows? Okay, we need to infuse some magical personality into this space. Living room, dining room. Mm -hmm. This is where you spend time. Yes. I heard you guys like to entertain, have friends over. Yes. You guys are into Harry Potter. Yes, indeed. <laughs> what is the blanket hiding? Um, a white um, couch. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. White, white with quotations. Right, right. I appreciate this move. Yeah. Is this a what DIY is... air oh. filter? It looks like it works. <laughs> it works. I'm oh so God, sad that you showed people that. <laughs> Alright, so you guys have an awkward floor plan here. Project, make it a better flow for you guys having friends over, and also take these wonderful colorful personalities I see in front of me and reflect them in the space. Boom. Harry Potter. <laughs> yes, magic sparkles. <laughs> For the design snapshot, I'm gonna share with you guys a little bit of the design so you can just see where I'm headed color palette wise. I'm gonna start with these Lick Squared prints. This is from Antelope Canyon, Arizona. I love these pinks and purples. You can see I'm bringing that in as well as some texture with a throw pillow and of course some plants because plants bring the life and this space really needs some life. I'm totally obsessed with this vignette. Just gonna snap it from my Snapchat and my Insta story. Follow me, P.S. Oh. Fresh coat of paint does wonders. Right. Joey got the tiny roller. Trade me. <laughs> what? Why? No, Joey, you can handle it. You're manly enough to handle the tiny roller. Please. Well, don't do it like that. Embrace it. Joey and Aisha definitely have the painting covered, so I'm gonna take Adeza outside to upcycle their old dining chairs. When we get back, the room better be painted. I like your style. Okay, I was just gonna say, how is my technique? Uh, uh, uh. Oh my gosh! Somebody do something! <laughs> <laughs> so 
these old dining chairs match the table. I'm gonna keep the table wood, but I like the idea of updating a bit and making it feel less dated by painting these and bringing them a new life. We are just going to sand them down, take off that shiny finish, and then prime them with a white primer and paint them. Because they're mismatched set, we're gonna embrace that and paint two of them a beautiful pale pink and the other two a black to bring in some contrast, because why not, guys? One of the things we're gonna do in this space to bring a little more style is get rid of their dated vertical blinds and give them some curtains. Surprised? I didn't think so. We're also gonna take off their old light fixture, which was pretty dingy and really didn't give off a lot of light. And we're gonna hook them up with a brand new modern fixture that's gonna have triple the amount of light bulbs in it to really help brighten up the space. And it's also gonna really help anchor this dining room area. Ladies, hello! Hi. You're discovering all the magical yes. items. Yes. Both of you are just magical beings. I thought it would be fun while we break beige to also break the beige of these wands. So I found the beigest wands possible. So these are just some random little fun things. It'll be sort of like a representation of your magical, colorful amazingness. Thank Love you. it. Swish, Swish and, and flick. flick. Yeah. Bye! <laughs> All right, while I leave these girls to their magical wand wizardry, Joey and I have a lot of work to do to get this place together before the sun goes down. I'm pretty sure they haven't cleaned their floor since they moved in here. I mean, people get so uninspired in their places, they just like give up. No, Joey! First thing we are gonna be putting down this amazing wool shag rug. It has a diamond pattern and braided tassels. This is going to anchor the new conversation area. Against the main wall where the TV used to be, we are giving them a brand new luxurious couch that only costs a couple hundred bucks with a really cool coffee table. It's got two levels. This is gonna be perfect for their entertaining or their feet while they're relaxing. One of their big problems is seating when they have their friends over. So I'm gonna add two tufted teal chairs with a cute little side table and a nice leafy faux tree in the corner in a pattern basket. Yo, I like the pattern. That's the way to break beige is with pattern. What the? <gasps> what the? Joey, I can't gone wrong. That's about right. I can't fail. Okay, it's fine, I can shorten this. Go grab something So what, else. take a piece out? And also shorten this cord too. Go take a piece, piece out. out. Take a piece, take a momentary piece out, would you? It's like an island <gasps> dream. Yes. I love it. Oh my god, look at this. Princess Cheech. It's my glam mermaid. Guess what? Uh-oh. Avada Kedavra. <gasps> Sorry. Oh my god, are you serious? Sorry. Yeah, well, Lumos. What is that gonna do? The lights are already on. Okay, well, it'll blind you, huh? Ridiculous! Crucio! Expecto Patronum! Stop it us! <laughs> <laughs> what is all of this Latin? Oh my god! <laughs> Those are amazing! This is exactly what I was hoping for, slash my mind is blown. Add away, because that's gonna be our finishing touch on the room. If you have to leave this room, just I'm ups. Okay. I'm ups. Okay. Mm -hmm. We've had this really cool scalloped swivel chair at the Mr. Kate Studios for a while, and this little corner by the front sliding door is perfect. I'm also placing a simple side table with hairpin legs next to the sofa and a beautiful table lamp on top. Oh, by the way, I actually designed this lampshade with Lamps Plus. For the wall of the TV is gonna go on, we're using a big white bookshelf, and we're gonna make a cool built-in effect with the TV by mounting the TV inside the bookshelf. On the other wall above the couch, we're gonna hang a really rad mirror art piece. We didn't paint the walls in here. Yeah. This is the color that just came with the rental apartment that they're in. I was here. Welcome. <laughs> this is a great tip. If you want to add color to your walls without painting them, just bring in some beautiful artwork. So we're going to have one print there and one print here. Yeah, okay. And you're not even going to see the paint on the walls anymore. These are really cool because they're basically interchangeable mats. So pop these off. Shoop. And then this holds it in. Yep. And then these just go back in, right? Yep. It's really cool because of the acrylic. Done it in. looks like glass. They're both going to be centered with the fixture. Yay! So pretty. So pretty. I love the movement and the texture. 
centered under the new light fixture and by these beautiful, colorful photographs, we are going to reuse their old table and add their newly upcycled dining chairs that look so cool in this pale pink and the nice contrasting black. We added a little sideboard and on top I'm placing a beautiful plant. I'm also placing this beautiful ceramic piece, these adorable square espresso mugs on a wooden tray. These ones turned out so magical. I die. Oh my gosh. Okay, we have to display these so cute in this shadow box. I'm just using some stuffing to make sure they're going to stay in there nicely. I'm also going to hand write a quote for them, just something to remind them that they're magical and this space is magical because of them. And we're going to frame this quote in a beautiful gold frame with a thick mat I got at the thrift store. Oh, and by the way, guys, you can buy this quote for yourself on shop.mrkate.com. I'm freaking out a little bit. Okay. I'm nervous, but I think they'll be okay. Yeah. I really hope it's like airy and like, I don't know, clean. Clean. <laughs> yeah, me too. I really hope that she's like solved our like yeah whole TV watching situation. Totally. Ah, I think it'll be okay. okay. Okay, I'm like a hundred percent gonna cry. Yeah. Look at the ground. All right, so now I'm gonna lead okay. you in. Now you're gonna step over the threshold. Stop there you in. go. <laughs> One, two, three. Oh. My God. <laughs> someone sitting here, you know, yeah. for movie nights, etc. You did away with your kind of hideous vertical blind. <laughs> we put them under your bed so you can put okay. them back when you move out. Cool. As much as I loved the ingenuity, <laughs> we got you. Your very own air purifier. Uh <laughs> <laughs> so you can enjoy fresh air in your fresh room. <laughs> did we break your beige? Uh, yeah, beige is officially broke. That's where we leave. We got more beige to break. We'll dance out of the door. Like, they danced us in. Woo! This is so awesome. Can't. Can't. Right. Dead. 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 Woo! Aisha and Adessa! Yes! They were so fun. They are so fun. They love their place. I'm so thrilled. They just have such amazing personalities. I hope you guys loved this video. You guys, subscribe, comment. Yeah. Let's get to, like, 60,000 likes, Woo! and hey, maybe next time you'll be on Breaking Beige. Oh, boom. Love you, creative weirdos. See you next time. Peace out, peace out, peace out. They're just like yelling at it, and it's like poised to jump on my face. Ah! Wait, come here. Ah! Up, up.